we don't really have a motto or a slogan or anything. We've, I think we've kind of stayed away from that. We we joke about it that we you know we just we just make beer. We're not, you know, we're not saving lives here. We just we just make beer. with Holy City Brewing, uh, the name, because Charleston is the Holy City. Skyline's dominated by steeples, and we felt like it was a perfect fit for a local Charleston brewery. We decided to open our own brewery because we love craft beer, and we love brewing together, and we saw a niche in the market that wasn't there, and thought Charleston would be a good place to sell local beer. My favorite part about brewing beer is really that it's a combination between two things that I love, science and food and bev. Uh, I was a geology major in college and I worked in food and bev for pretty much the only jobs I've ever had. And um, I always felt like it was a good combination between the two, a little you know, creative outlet, but it was also scientific. Some of the challenges we've had opening, I mean for us it's mainly dealing with a building that wasn't fit for a brewery, trying to form this building for a brewery, drains on the floor, you know, water being able to go outside the building underneath the wall and little things like that to try and make a brewery work in this environment. You know, it takes a lot of extra cleaning in a building like this because we are open garage. And as a business, it's just all about growth and trying to gain more accounts. It's, you know, mainly maintaining those accounts and keeping the locals happy. And, we are heading out to the Great American Beer Fest in October. It'll be the first year that we head out there. We're submitting five beers this year. We're actually brewing one of them today. It's a smoked Meritzen, smoky German lager. Uh, we're also going to be submitting our porter, our pilsner, um, a brown ale that we put 75 pounds of roasted pecans in called Pecan Dream. And we'll all be going out there, the whole group from the brewery, for the four days and you know, hanging out and talking to people, pouring beers, and hopefully winning some medals. When someone's Finish drinking a Holy City pint. You know, I hope they want another one. Definitely want people to understand that I like. We brew pretty. We try and brew two style. We also want to put our own twist on it. We're not doing anything really crazy and super outside the box. We have a couple beers that are way outside the box, but we try and stick to some specific styles. So I want them to have an enjoyable experience with the beer and understand what goes into it. And you know, the love and the you know, it's a handcrafted product. It takes me a lot of time to make and. Hopefully they want another one.